All right, sexy human, let's talk about how to manifest with the Gemini new moon happening on June the 6th, the 6th portal, yay. <laughs> so this portal is definitely a fun manifestation portal. So if you are ready to manifest in a fun way, this new moon is definitely one I want you to be working with, okay? In this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you the three ways, okay? Practical ways, you know how we do. Practical ways on how you can manifest miracles right now. So if you're interested, Keep on watching. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Oh my gosh, Gemini new moon. Lots of fun, lots of flirty energy. Let's get into manifestation. So welcome back guys, this is Tina Wong and uh, on this channel we talk about spirituality, how you can work with the cosmic energy and how you can step into your truest and highest alignment. So if you're vibing with that, like this video, subscribe to the channel and of course be here. It is free and I love to have you here. So let's talk about manifestation, one of my favorite topics. Okay, so number uno, let's talk about this. So the first way that you can manifest with this fun, flirty, intellectual, you know, sexy, um, spontaneous <laughs> new moon is definitely broaden your network, broaden your horizon through socialization, communication, going out, partying, okay? So, I mean, you don't have to party, but you know, be social. So, this first way is definitely the representation of Gemini, the social butterfly of the zodiac. So, this is the energy where, you know, usually if you are a hermit like myself, and by the way, if you haven't seen uh, watch the video of the five ways of how this new moon affects you watch it down below there's so much good stuff in there and how you can work with the energy but how you can manifest with this new moon is really utilizing the network utilizing your communication skills and utilizing the people the humans the events the opportunity right it, you know there's a um, there's a saying like teamwork makes a dream work right and also life is not about riding solo okay i know sometimes modern society makes us think like we should be riding solo but that's not the vibe okay we are here to grow together we are here to collaborate right it's like you cannot do you know when someone say they're self-made it's not true you know it's not true like you you need people hello <laughs> you need people you you know like did you build your toilet toilet right did you build your house like you know we're not independent we're not you know we're not designed to be so Gemini is reminding us like if you have any like I rise solo mentality this is the time to break free of that and really inviting new energies coming in you know maybe you can partner with a professional to take your business further maybe you can you know collaborate with a an editor to get your book out you know maybe you can collab collaborate with another person to get your brand your impact your voice out whatever right so this is a time where you want to be networking you want to be socializing you want to be going to events party out in the world travel just get out okay please guys just let get out and the thing is if you guys are manifesting let's say an investor you never know who you go meet okay during this time and maybe you be man you want to be manifesting a new friend, new people in your circle, new love, new romantic partner, baby. Who knows? Who knows who's hot, handsome, sexy, beautiful? Who knows who is out there right now? But you gotta get out to know, honey. So this is basically a very practical way to work with this Gemini. Your communication style is gonna be naturally easeful, smooth, fun, and flirty, okay? So if you're thinking that, you know, maybe I'm a bit awkward, Tina, like I don't really like to talk to people, I like to hide like you, <laughs> you know, I know, uh, I understand you. But you know, th basically this new moon has that energy of just like, it's so easy to make friends, you know, like you just see someone, you laugh over an apple together or something, and then you're like, oh my God, we are best friends, okay? Or like, you know, conversation is gonna be a lot easier. So highly encourage, get out there, get some sun, get some fresh air, you know? And see who you meet and let me know down below, okay? Give me the juicy, juicy. Number two, the number two practical way on how you can manifest with the, this new moon in Gemini is definitely be playful, okay? Be playful and not take things so seriously. 
you know sometimes when we think about manifesting the big things right like you know the home the husband the wife the career the whatever right impacting the world sometimes we think of it as a big deal we put it on the pedestal and then sometimes we just you know there's a resistance on how to get there you know what i'm talking about this gemini new moon i want to be chill playful humorous even and just really have fun you know and i'll I'll give you an example you know my when i was growing my youtube channel you know of course at the beginning (laughs) at the beginning of the game i maybe i took it more seriously okay honestly guys if you guys know you know i used to make 12 videos a day okay okay if you know that story you know that story but you know i was serious okay i was serious i was like da 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 this is this you know blah 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 you know and even growing my business and everything you know i i think i took it more seriously and then now i have a very chill and playful approach because it's like why so serious right quote the joker because when you're too serious you know and i've coached a lot of people i've coached over hundreds like i feel it's like six hundred students on how to start a YouTube channel and how to get their voices out there in in an authentic way and what I find is that you got to be authentic honey right you're gonna be real you're gonna be you you're gonna be fun and you're gonna be flirty okay maybe you don't have to be flirty but you know I like to be you know it's just fun right when you're just feeling yourself you're not taking yourself so seriously your personality gets through your authenticity get through you know and the reason why I'm connecting with my people and this is how I coach and mentor people people is that you just have to be relaxed have to be chill right and don't take it so seriously you know i'm not gonna be here and be like three ways to manifest okay we're gonna talk about this we're gonna be this you know you have to add some personality yes you're gonna add some fun and flair and you make it you so that's the thing your attraction factor your magnetism is definitely all the way up when you are in your authenticity when you are in your playfulness when you are chill baby all right so for those of you who are ready to step it up a notch you are ready to get your voice out in an authentic way and you know what i find is that it works so much better ever since i made the switch to not being you know so serious and fake you know to being more real and just being me it just is it's it's a different it's a, it's night and day you know the the people who connect with me you know the clients that i work with the way that i'm able to help people the way i'm able to have that instant connection just so much easier so i would highly you know give that a try and if you're looking for a coach or mentor to personally take you through this definitely send me a message on my instagram at tina1000 right now i have a couple of spots where i can work with you one-on-one to grow your voice your your impact and your platform or we have some programs for you too of course so just have a chat with me if i can help you of course i'm here for that way number three the way number three on how you can manifest with this uh, moon in gemini is definitely pair up okay i talked about this in the five ways on how this moon affects you so again make sure you watch it down below and i'll also be making um a guided meditation i know you guys love the guided meditation so you're definitely gonna get that when it comes to help you with the manifestation so the thing is sometimes we think you know our manifestation is between us and the universe and then universe will just somehow make our wish come true when we put it out there and we close our eyes and we open it not exactly (laughs) okay so how manifestation works is that the universe needs vessels to deliver okay so meaning that your manifestation will come to you okay will come to you from the divine through a vessel okay we got it capito so the idea here is that you need the vessels okay baby you need the vessels so where are the vessels people people you gotta partner up Okay. If there's an opportunity when you when you're saying like okay, I'm asking, I'm asking the universe for an opportunity to let's say get my um, my business out there, you know, out to more people. And then you you yourself expect that when you open your eyes, you know, after you're done praying, it will happen. But reality, more often than not, is maybe you're going out. Okay, after you set that intention. You go out and then you meet someone, you mingle with them at an event or whatever, a mixer or whatever it is. 
and then you're like oh my gosh are you also um in this area oh my god do you also have a youtube channel oh my god do you also um an author or whatever you know and then you're like why don't we partner up and you know share this to our platform to share to our audience or whatever it is that's the way a very practical way for you to expand your network you see what the universe does is that it puts that person in front of you puts that person at that party that you're meant to go to right and maybe you're meeting the perfect you know publisher or uh, book whatever editor person that is designed to put your work out there but you need to take the action and you need to say okay let's partner up let's collaborate let's work together okay this new moon is amazing time for networking it's amazing time for you to change up your vibe change up your who is in your circle the new energy and it's also an amazing time for your career okay believe it or not gemini is definitely about you know doing all the things it, it's multi-passionate it's multi-faceted but the thing with gemini is that it moves fast it's curious it gets bored easily so if you are in this energy of like I am ready for something new. I'm ready to do so many things. Take it lightly. Don't be like, oh my gosh, I feel so bad that I start something and I didn't finish it. Maybe you're meant to start this right now, right? Maybe you're meant to finish it in July, you know, give yourself a break. Um, Maybe you're meant to just have the connection right now. Maybe nothing comes to fruition yet, but you're meant to just talk to that person right start talking about the plans to execute right how you guys can work together how you guys can couple up together you know stuff like that so don't put the pressure on yourself that things need to manifest now because this new moon is about seeding the manifestation okay so you just gotta be patient i mean that's not to say that things cannot come now but usually closer to the full moon that's when the receiving of the manifestation happens but new moon very crucial okay that you're utilizing this energy to seed to build connection to nurture you know your network to nurture fresh connection and fresh energy that comes into your life and especially don't take it too seriously have fun be playful and definitely using this time to set that seed of intention so that you can reap your rewards baby in the full moon so like this video if you got anything let me know down below what you think was coming through for you and of course subscribe to the channel i love to have you here i love you i love you i love you and i'll see you soon